Hey folks, Matt from Art of the Image. So Canon is coming out in support of Intel's new Thunderbolt, the new PC high-speed connection that is 10 gigabytes per second. Yes, you heard me right, 10 gigabytes per second. Uh, I can think of all the wonderful things that we could use this for. Basically, uh, I could see it replacing um, I, uh, USB 3 or USB 2, I should say. Um, it seems like it is replacing USB 3. We haven't heard much about USB 3, and it almost seems like Intel is leapfrogging into Thunderbolt. In any case, uh, Canon has come out in support of it. Uh, they, now, they haven't said that they will guarantee any of their cameras will support it, but especially video and video DSLRs with a Thunderbolt connection, how cool would that be um, if we get into beyond 1080 HD, all of a sudden you're shooting maybe 4K or something, and you're talking massive data transfer, but now you could have a Thunderbolt connection plugged into your digital SLR or into your Canon video camera and be shooting directly to a high-speed hard drive, say an SSD. So, uh, pretty cool technology. Um, are we going to see this in the cameras? I think you probably are going to see it as long as Thunderbolt becomes a, uh, a you know a, a default for the industry. Um, how soon is another matter. Will Canon have it out in anything this year? Probably not. Will Nikon? Probably not. However, once it becomes established in the computer industry, once it, you, you see it normal to pick up a PC that has a Thunderbolt connection on it or a Mac that has a Thunderbolt connection on it, um, and that is the mainstream normal connection, then I think you're going to see the support for this in the newer cameras. So uh, pretty interesting. Um, let me know what you think. Post down in the comments below. Are you interested in your camera having a Thunderbolt connection? Do you shoot a lot of video? Do you think this would be a big uh, a big deal for you? Um, what about if the new cameras, when they get up to like 4K video, uh, you know, well above the uh, the 1080p, and they're going to need massive storage that compact flash cards aren't just going to accommodate? Do you think Thunderbolt will solve that? So uh, let me know. Put your thoughts down below. Let me know what you're thinking about that. And uh, thanks for tuning in, folks. Stay tuned. We'll be back soon with some new video posts, some new articles, and we'll keep you up to date with what's going on in the world of photography. Thanks a lot.